Now we are discussing about yoga. In that we are discussing about karma yoga. What is karma yoga? Karma yoga is path to reach moksha through work. It is a rightful action without being attached to fruits or being manipulated by what the results might be. A dedication to one's study, one's duty and trying one's best while being neutral to rewards or outcomes such as success or failure. What are the four major laws of Karma Yoga, principles of Karma Yoga? Right motive, some attitude, some same as attitude, do your duty, often duty is referred as to as righteousness, do your best, whatever you have to do, do your best and give up results, God is the dear, doer, give results, give up results, God is the doer, serve God or the self in all. Do to others what you would like to do, done to yourself. This is the information regarding karma yoga laws. And then how do I do, how do I start karma yoga? How to practice karma yoga? Karma arises due to desires are not from our actions. Don't neglect your daily duties and responsibilities. Actions give govern our ex existence. Re renunciation is not mistaken for an escape from our daily duties and responsibilities. Learn to engage your minds to uh, contemplation. Then what is the benefits of Karma Yoga? Karma Yoga is all about doing your duty without thinking about yourself. The main purpose of Karma Yoga is to control, eventually let go of your yoga, ego of your ego. It is essential that the practice of Karma Yoga, you don't involve ego, your ego, because only then you can do it without attachment and desire. How, I can, how can I attract good karma? Step one is love and forgive yourself. Most people at one time or another find themselves battling low self-esteem, self-blame and self-doubt. And step two is love and forgive others. Holding a grudges hold, holds you back. So love, love and forget, forgive others. And then step three is practice kindness and compassion. Step four is reflect. And step five is practice. Then what are the characteristics of karma yoga? A karma yogi believe, employee, a karma yogi employee displays five characters which are emphasis a process than outcome and then obligation towards others and then act with equanimity and then seek perfection that is excellence in action and then to regard work as an offering to higher self. That will be considered as Ishwara Pranidhana. Then uh, next question is, how do you dissolve past karma? This is most important. How do you dissolve past karma? Some strategy is to get rid of your bad karma. Identity, identify your karma. Severe ties to toxic people. Learn from your mistakes. Perform actions that nourish your spirit and invoke well-being on every level and you defy your weaknesses, take a new action, forgive everyone. How do you integrate Karma Yoga in your life? Five steps to practicing Karma Yoga in your daily life. Start with your authentic self. Becoming self-aware is the first step to practicing a life of Karma Yoga. Practice compassion, positivity and gratitude. Say hello, smile and love. Take care of the world around you. Contribute. This is the information. And then next question is, what is the symbol of karma? Lotus symbolically represents karma in many Asian traditions. A blooming lotus flower is one of the few flowers that simultaneously carries seeds inside itself while it blooms. Seed is symbolically seen as cause. In the flower effect that is the information. So, the symbol of karma is lotus. 
lotus flower then uh, can you reverse karma that is also most important in eastern philosophy you good you get uh, bad karma when you act selfishly selfishly and dishonestly it is bad karma however you can reverse your bad karma with a love kindness and understanding if you have hurt someone the first step is to apologize to them take responsibility for your actions and do what you can to what you can to make it up to the person and then next question is what is karmic healing karmic healing gives us imaginative access to our past lives and thereby an approach to releasing the pathological imprint imprints we experienced there and a way to explore the possibilities for spiritual growth that our higher mind calls us toward what are the 10 laps 10 laws of karma what are the 10 laws of karma the law of change forgiving then giving you cause of cause and effect the law of change the law of forgiving the law of giving the law of cause and effect the law of growth the law of responsibility and the law of mindfulness and the law of connectivity these are the karma yoga informations and laws of karma so likewise so for in this one question is can you reverse karma yes it can be it can do you know in our bauda jataka kadas also jataka stories also how to um, Uh, reverse our karma that means bad karma means by donation by helping poor and by helping uh, uh, disabled 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 persons likewise uh, you are you are and, uh, and uh, helping to um, uh, that is <coughs> that is uh, hospitalized persons and all these things will reduce your karma in this germ in this birth only so likewise so many are there even if you go with your uh, uh, birth chart what to do to reduce your karma also they will say very well so every astrons astrology sciences also we can utilize for the good growth of our selves that is the information and karma yoga is the best yoga and you can do according to your availability and all the things wishing you all the best